Did you know that the answer to our growing plastic pollution crisis might be crawling around in poultry farms? Scientists have discovered a new species of mealworm larvae native to Africa that can eat and break down polystyrene, commonly known as styrofoam. Polystyrene is widely used in food and industrial packaging, but it's notorious for being incredibly durable and tough to recycle. Traditional recycling methods are expensive and often release pollutants, so researchers have been looking for biological solutions, and they've hit the jackpot with the Kenyan lesser mealworm. This tiny insect, the larval form of the Alphatobius darkling beetle, has bacteria in its gut that can break down polystyrene. Found mostly in warm poultry rearing houses, these mealworms chew through plastic with surprising efficiency. In a study by the International Center of Insect Physiology and Ecology, scientists fed these mealworms three different diets, polystyrene alone, nutrient-rich bran, and a combination of both. The results? Mealworms on the polystyrene bran diet thrived, breaking down about 11.7% of the total polystyrene during the trial period. Those fed polystyrene alone survived, but were less efficient, highlighting the importance of a balanced diet. So why can these insects eat plastic? The answer lies in their gut bacteria. Scientists discovered that the guts of polystyrene-fed larvae contained higher levels of bacteria like proteobacteria and firmicutes, known for breaking down complex substances. Specific bacteria, such as Cloivera and Lactococcus, produce enzymes that digest synthetic plastics. These microbes adapt to the mealworm's unusual diet, making them key players in the plastic degradation process. But here's the exciting part. Researchers believe they can isolate these bacteria and their enzymes for large-scale recycling efforts. Instead of releasing millions of mealworms into landfills, we could harness these microbial tools in factories or cleanup sites to tackle plastic waste faster and more efficiently. This discovery is particularly groundbreaking for Africa, where plastic pollution is at critical levels due to low recycling rates. By focusing on species native to the region, this research offers new solutions tailored to local environmental conditions. What's next? Scientists aim to scale up enzyme production for broader recycling applications and test the mealworm's ability to degrade other types of plastics. They're also looking into the long-term health of mealworms on plastic diets and the potential use of their biomass as animal feed. With innovations like these, the fight against plastic pollution might soon have some unexpected allies, tiny but mighty Kenyan mealworms. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and let us know your thoughts on this incredible discovery in the comments below.